Now at 5.30, cleanup underway tonight in East Cleveland after an out-of-control van slammed into a building. Buried in that rubble, a nonprofit that helped East Cleveland's low-income community. Five of your side investigator Scott Knoll live in the newsroom with more. Today's crash was just the latest blow for our family home center. The founder says already this month he's been hit by thieves and now a runaway van. Tire tracks on a sidewalk lead to a scene of devastation. Cliff Williams is still trying to digest. And I said, oh my God. East Cleveland police say the driver of a van told them the vehicle's brakes went out as the van came down this hill on Lee Road. At the bottom, Williams nonprofit, our family home center. The van crashed through a wall and glass block windows. Books and other donated items buried. If I try to put a price on it, it's priceless, really, because it was for the people. Everything over there is for them. Williams says this hits particularly hard. Seems like I'm getting kicked right now. All my ribs is gone. This is where I feel. That's because he says thieves hit here twice last week. They took my hygiene kits. Now what is they going to do with them? I was giving them, I give them to him when they walk in. But as bad as this looks, William says he's not giving up, hoping to find some way to continue with his weekly meals for the hungry and programs for the kids. He says the need here is great and close to William's heart. I was homeless on drugs, so I know how it feel. Knows how important places like this can be. Knows this is a community that needs him. They cannot chase me away. I got a whole lot of people going back me up. And I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep those people behind me. I don't care. If they don't burn the building down, I still be there. Police say no one was hurt in that crash. An officer told me the driver of the van did have insurance. Live in the newsroom on five on your side investigator Scott Knoll.